I want to share some exciting news. We've rebuilt our redaction recall feature from scratch to make it way better. In case you're unfamiliar, I do recalls redaction recalls feature allows you to mask portions of text and images inside of your recalls. So you can challenge yourself during memory retrieval to recall what's hidden beneath the mask portions. Creating redaction recalls is super easy. You just go into the create a new recall screen. You can enter any text you want, like what are the parts of the brain. I'm gonna become a neuroscience genius at the end of this. And then you can paste in an image that you find in one of your lectures or online, resize it as much as you want. And then you're gonna click redaction mode up here, which is gonna bring you into the redaction composer. Here you can drag redaction rectangles over the regions that you want to redact and mask. There are two different modes you can choose from, progressive or non-progressive. Progressive mode is gonna create a single flashcard where during practice you can click to unmask one redaction at a time as you exercise your memory to recall what's hidden beneath it. If you uncheck this, it's gonna create six different recalls each with their own redaction and own star rating. We pre-fill the title for the recall here so that it's anonymous and you won't be spoiled in the recalls list to what the recall is going to be on, but you can feel free to edit it as much as you want. What does this actually look like inside of practice? If we save that, go here, then we can see every single one of the redactions goes just like that. Five stars. I'm a neuroscience genius. As part of this update, you can open the redactions at any time you want to, and you can simply edit them inside of the page like this. You can add new redactions. You can resize them as much as you want. Redaction recalls are a powerful tool for creating recalls that test your memory to recall information, which you can use for cell tables, sequences of lists, lyrics in a song, steps in a formula. The possibilities are endless. Soon we'll be adding redaction recalls to our web clipper as well, so that you can use them and create them just online on any website. I hope that was helpful and have a great rest of your day.